sake of saying this, uh, I'm going to say very clearly right from the outset, there's no such thing as neutral ground. All right, let's start from the beginning. It's pretty easy. Imagine a simple playing field. The father says, I'm drawing a line. My side is where I want all you children of mine to play. I don't want you stepping over the line into the statement area. My side here is safe. It's called righteous. It's where the uh, saints play. My children, those who are of me. You cross that line there, you're in Satan's jurisdiction. And don't let anyone deceive you. That's Satan. Well, okay, so things are pretty good right off the bat. The kids understand, don't break the rules. Uh, there's plenty of room in Father's side. Uh, never have to touch uh, anywhere near Satan's side. Well, we you know, it's some child that uh, happens to wander over near that fence. That's fine. And Satan tricks him. Comes over with a uh, uh, smiley face kind of an attitude and says, Hey, kid, come on over here. I got lots of fun things to play with. The kids says, oh, no, 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 not me. I'm not allowed to cross that line. That's Satan's area. The smiley face person says, oh, no, no. Satan's area is way past that line. Here, look. This section to this line is a, an area called neutral. See, it's like a demilitarized zone. You'll understand that when you get older. But this part's neutral. It's safe. Don't worry about it. God said, well, maybe that isn't quite the line. Uh, let me try this. And he goes over the uh, line and finds that he's standing in the middle of this neutral zone. And, and guess what? Nothing happened to him. Oh, other things have happened. So he and a couple of his other friends start playing a little bit further away into the neutral area every once in a while. And nothing ever happens to him. Of course, the father's been away on vacation, handling other issues like part of the universe. But Kids that know this are staying away from that line altogether. The kids that are in the neutral zone, the zone you know, well, those other ones must be crazy because nothing's happening to them. We're, we're having fun. There's, there's toys to play with over here that, that aren't over on the other side. Well, wouldn't you know it, after time goes by, uh, quite a few kids get so used to being in the neutral zone uh, that uh, that neutral zone line keeps getting moved further and further away from the father's original line. And some kids start dabbling. Right against that line that the, the smiley face guy drew, and he starts putting on uh, sort of scary masks and stuff. They're getting into Satan. What are you doing? They're right on the fence. What they don't realize is they're in Satanism, uh, but in, in an almost perfect sense. Well, anyway, so they, they try to divide neutral zone up into different areas themselves. They seem to have neutral zone. Part of the zone that's close to the, to the Father's righteous zone, and deep that Father's righteous zone. Well, because it will compromise and still be the Father's zone then. And then, of course, to the other side of that zone, they draw another line and say, okay, that part is getting a little bit close to the uh, space zone. Let's just keep away from that and sort of just leave it for the really bad kids. So what most kids do is find another neutral zone in between the, the two that they just created. And they start calling that uh, the real neutral zone. So imagine now this man has now created this three-stage neutral zone inside Satan's jurisdiction. Now, if you're following me here, and I hope the illustrations look as clear as I'm expecting them to, then you'll understand that that area closest to the Father is what they're now going to call Christianity. Now, those that think they're in Christianity, because there's so many of them, are going to look 